It is one of the most eagerly awaited days on the footballing calendar. This is the day when teams turn up for work with a spring in their step. First time in this competition this season, a genuine sense of occasion, a bit of fanfare that goes with it. The mood is upbeat, laced with a dose of nerves, which must be expected. The team news is in, the teams themselves will be with us shortly. The atmosphere predictably wonderful. This must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. Beijing Guan looking for a fast start to get things done early here. Yes, and that's very apparent, Peter. Competition football is a different beast entirely. And you have to be prepared to dig deep to prevent everything going south very quickly. So this could be a, a tentative standoff in weighing each other up. I hope we'll see more probing than possession. Now we're on the way. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Has a hit! He's delivered all right! Listen, it's a great start, but we've seen teams surprise themselves with early goals before and sit back. They've got to avoid that. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Now, that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Beijing Guan, go ahead, one goal to the good. Gets wrestled off the ball, and that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Bakambu. Played down the flank. He's in space and looking for options. Hoists it forward, and the counter is on. Battles to win it back. Gets the better of his man. Strong challenge, but what? Real chance! It's certainly livened things up a bit, and that next goal now was absolutely crucial. He was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. But for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Well, I think this is a case of anything you can do, we can do too. I mean, they're matching each other like for like here. Shot at goal! Goes for goal! Just off target. Look, I'm sure he'll deny it, Peter, but the keeper didn't have that covered. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Beijing Guan, get it back again. And it's back the Kabu! And that's caused a worry or two. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though.
That's a brilliant interception. Tries a shot! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. All he'd be thinking is, please, ground, swallow me up. Lays it out to the flank. It's a great gallop down the right-hand side. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Bakambu in with the challenge Bakambu it's found its way to him oh shooting chance oh taken with style into the lead once more really outwitted one on one once more he gets the better of the keeper well how's that for composure Peter you can see the keeper tried to put as much pressure on him by staying upright, but it didn't phase him, not in the slightest. So we have a breakthrough. Now, how will things develop from here? And there's the end of the first half. So a really good half of football, three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. Beijing Guan head into the half-time break with a narrow lead, two goals to one. So we're just settling back into this second half. No changes at the interval from either side. Gets into some space. Renato Augusto. Gets it into the middle. Massive lead! Good delivery, but no joy. Well, being able to generate that amount of activity in the box means it's hard not to pick someone out. Tries to get it forward quickly. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Forward it goes. Dangerous looking ball, and it's come to nothing. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Oh, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. It just has to be done. Out to the left it goes. That's good defending, very good defending. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Oh, 
Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Cuts it out. And it's played forward. It's come through and he's had a quick look inside. Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue this situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. Now the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Beijing Guan. And that will be the final act. Beijing Guan. I've got off to an ideal start. Three points on day one, and it bodes well for the campaign ahead. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Listen, ideally, any new campaign needs a start that puts three points on the board, and it's mission accomplished. Nothing too fancy was required, just a, a good, solid team display for me.